Buying Robux. I have a great idea. Click on the amount of Robux you are about to buy. Click here and enter my star code Sunny. Welcome back to my channel. Since you guys absolutely love it when I expose scammers, I decided to make another part of exposing scammers. Today, we are going to be doing honesty tests. We are going to see if they lie about the pet or if they don't. And yeah, I'm really excited. Let's begin with the video. However, obviously, before we get started, make sure to like and subscribe if you would like your dream pet in my inventory. And of course, comment down below your username as well as your dream pet. Anyways, let's go ahead and begin the video. Alright, so we need to change our outfit into a little bit of a beginner outfit so then people will know that they can trick us easily. Because guys, if we look like our Sunny X Misty outfit, people will know not to mess with us, otherwise we are going to expose them. However, we are going to expose them anyways in our poor outfit. So I think this should be good. Actually, maybe something else. Maybe this. Okay, I like this. And I'm also going to get rid of the face because I want to look like we are actually a noob. As you can see, even my roleplay name is noob please teach me how to play okay so what we're gonna go ahead and now take out is a good pet and what we're gonna do is we are gonna pretend somebody was actually trust trading us this pet and we kind of accidentally scammed them and we are trying to find the original owner so let's go ahead and go to the main oh look there's a girl over here i was gonna say let's go to the main map to find somebody but this girl called mia i guess we can um go ahead and try to test her out she's saying oh my god which probably means that she's really shocked to see a mega owl excuse me ella preppy uses preppy values oh she's a preppy i really hate preppy values and i never ever use them hey can i offer that's my dream pet i can't trade this mega owl i need to return it to the correct owner well this mega owl isn't mine i'm gonna go ahead and make up a random story so i just told them i was trust trading someone they gave me this mega owl but when i was about to give it back they left hmm maybe this girl knows something about it oof well, if she's not the owner, then I need to find that person that actually is the owner of the Mega Owl, which is me. However, we are doing an honesty test on her. I'll help you find it. Oh, okay, so she is a really nice person. Guys, I don't actually think she's a scammer. She seems like a really nice and sweet, helpful person. Thank you so much. Oh, um, she's like, trade me so I can give it back to them. Well, it's a nice thing of her to try to help us, but I don't think I want to give it to her because what about if she scams and just leaves us? Or maybe she just never finds this person and basically scams us as well. So I want to know how she's going to find this person that's missing their mega owl because I didn't give any descriptions about them. I know lots of people in Adopt Me. Yeah, but she definitely doesn't know 200,000 people, which is Adopt Me's active player list. Even I don't know 200,000 people. One of my friends told me she was trust trading her mega owl, then had to leave. This is kind of similar to the story I told her, and she's saying that her friend told her this. Maybe she's not lying, or maybe she's just completely making this story up. So what's her friend's username? I forgot lol. I definitely think she's lying. I mean, who forgets their own friend's username? I'm not gonna say anything yet, so I'm gonna put her up to the test. When did she lose her mega owl? Today. Well, I can't say yes or no to that because I didn't even trade her friend because this is literally my mega owl. But I'm just gonna kind of play along and I'm gonna be like, oh, it's not her then. Because I got this owl last week. Oh wait, what? She just wrote last week. As soon as I wrote last week. Um, okay. Sorry, lol. Okay, maybe she actually did lose it last week. I'm not really sure. She's saying it's, she's all blaming on autocorrects, but I don't know. I kind of believe her. I don't know. Should I put her up to another test, maybe, to see if she's actually a scammer or not? Okay, so I said, by the way, this owl's name wasn't always Fruit Pop. And actually, it was always Fruit Pop. Since I ever got a mega owl, it was always Fruit Pop. What was its original name? Let's see how creative she is and what name she's going to say. Oh, she said, I don't know that. Alright, well, it wasn't hers, so maybe she should just ask her friend then. Um, no, she's busy. Um, okay, maybe she is busy. I don't know. I'm no one to judge. I don't know who her friend is. I don't know about her life, so maybe she actually is busy. Just trade me so I can give it back to her. Well, she's kind of certain that this mega owl is her friend, but, um, it's really not. Sorry, but if you can't tell me the name, then I can't give it to you because right now you're just failing the test. Fine. She's like, fine, oh my god, is she actually gonna find out a name for her mega owl? 
it was boba isn't boba literally everybody's owl's name i don't know why but every single time i see an owl it is always called boba but it's a shame because its original name was not boba it was actually honey even though it was not we just made that up but still oh she's like honey now honey honey in literal capital letters i'm sorry but she just said it was literally boba so is it honey or boba it's honey so now she's gonna say it's honey as soon as we said honey that's kind of strange i actually think she might be a scammer guys i got confused with my mega owl oh so she has a mega owl too that's pretty cool i want to see her mega owl show me your mega owl not right now i'm i feel like she's lying about that too then just give me the mega owl so then i can give it back to the owner and she just sent me a trade request obviously i'm declining she's so angry she's like stop declining it's so annoying it's more annoying when you try to scam people are you sure it was your friend that got scammed yes now trade guys let me know down below in the comment section if you guys think she's a scammer or not i'm just gonna troll her and put in my mega owl she just accepted and she's telling me to accept too quick quick i'm sorry but i'm just gonna literally tell her what on earth i was doing nice try i was doing a social experiment to see who would scam and you are a scammer I don't even believe her fake stories anymore. She's like, no, I am not. Can you stop making stuff up? And she just declined the trade. Nice try, scammer. And now we're going to go ahead and move on to the next person. And hopefully they won't be a scammer like her. And she just left. So I just joined a different server. And I'm going to go ahead and take out... Oh my god, I just glitched. We're going to see what pet we should first of all take out. It needs to be a good pet. Oh, a parrot already popped out. So I guess we can do this mega parrot. And let's teleport to the gifts. Because we are literally standing on nothing right now. So hopefully this will kind of help us a little bit. There we go. So we are at the gift and it looks like a pretty rich server. Oh my god. Maybe one of these people are scammers. Even though they don't need to scam because they are already so rich. But still. So I unequipped everything and I'm like, I am poor. And I don't think anybody's gonna care. As you can see, literally nobody cares. And they're just minding their own business. Donations would help, please. Another poor person's like, me too. Well, at least somebody doesn't ignore me. Donations, please. Oh, it looks like she's also asking for donations. By the way, my items are off. So nobody actually gives me donations. Because I don't need donations at all. Anyways, it's time to kind of act like somebody gave us a free donation. So I'm gonna be like, oh my god, really? For me? Kind of just pretend pretending like i'm speaking to somebody that's really rich and just gave me something really good thank you so much i'm gonna take out the shadow dragon because i was gonna take out the mega parrots but i need lots and lots of attention from these people since they really just don't care about me so i'm gonna be like this is amazing oh my god and that poor girl's back and she's like kind of staring at us she's like wow somebody's really sarcastically saying yeah right and i don't think she believes us she's like i am poor too and she's just running off oh my god yeah we just got everybody's attention people People are just like wow and everything like that so now i'm gonna be like i was doing a social experiment to see who would give me stuff you can have it back now i'm kind of pretending like i'm speaking to the person that gave me this but i don't actually know who gave it to me can you give it to me i am poor too i think she's trying to speak to the person that she thinks gave it to me even though nobody gave it to me however this girl seems really desperate for pets so i'm gonna test her i'm like was it you who gave it to me yeah oh my god so she is gonna lie i kind of knew that and somebody's literally exposing me she's like you don't accept trades you are just faking it lol and i think it's because my trades are off give it back i am poor now this girl's funny i'm just gonna kind of play along with her i'll be like oh okay and i'm gonna trade her i just put the shadow dragon in and she's like thank you i mean it's not even hers and she didn't even give it to me she literally started off by saying she's poor so how on earth would she get this mega shadow dragon from anyways are you sure this is yours yeah oh my god she just lied again seriously oh she's a good actor she's like please give it back i miss my shadow dragon somebody in the chat was like give it back and now she's like no it's mine shut up so i just declined the trade because now i'm gonna test this guy called alex that's trying to pretend it's his alex is saying it's his i'm gonna make them kind of argue like the two scammers are gonna argue for the pets it's gonna be so funny i'm gonna trade alex now to see um what he says in chat so i just put in the mega shadow dragon and i'm like thank you so much for the mega shadow by the way he's like he tried to get my shadow even though it's literally a girl i think and she's she's literally screaming saying no it's mine no problem um you didn't give it to me anyways i'm gonna actually accept until it goes to confirm and we're just gonna decline after that it's mine trade oh she's so desperate everyone she doesn't accept trade so there is no point in lying lol you ain't getting it she just had it 
um yeah he's kind of right these two people are so pathetic i'm literally declining and i'm just gonna expose them in the chat in front of the whole of the dops me joking y'all are scammers why is he laughing he's like lol i feel like he kind of admitted it but this girl is still not admitting it she's like no i'm not only he is give me my mega shadow back i'm crying why is she crying for a pet that isn't even hers where is she running off to oh she's sat on a bench outside of the nursery guys she's such a guilt tripper she's literally guilt tripping me to giving her the mega shadow dragon and this guy just he's just literally back he's saying it's mine give it to me i was exposing scammers and you are the biggest scammer ever she's like get off me it's i think it's because he was sitting on top of her i'm not a scammer but she literally is i'm reporting you for scamming i'm literally getting reported for absolutely no reason this is so silly she's so annoying oh my god and this guy's also like me too great now i have two reports on my account i'm just gonna be like go ahead because reporting doesn't even do anything um okay are these two people literally like sisters or brothers or siblings or something stop copying <laughs> now she has someone else to be mad at i report <laughs> okay um she's so dramatic but okay and he just keeps on copying her good thing she kind of deserves that for being a scammer that was a strange server so luckily we just joined a new server i bet they're still arguing <laughs> but anyways guys since this is an honesty test i decided to do something a little bit different instead of saying is this pet yours there is a person over there and we're going to see if they are honest or not so what i'm gonna go ahead and do is i'm going to take out a good pet so i'm gonna take out maybe my mega giraffe i really like my mega giraffe it's called cinderella here she is cinderella and we're gonna change the name to for my idol and basically we're going to pretend go up to this girl with the new one unicorn and be like are you my idol and hopefully they get tempted because they can see that we're giving a mega giraffe to my idol i don't know if she's famous or not but we are going to pretend that she is we're going to do what fans usually do to me when they see me so they usually be like sunny is it really you so we're going to do that to her and her name is jake kind of different from other boys um so they're a boy my bad sorry they're like what uh, i think that's what they said you're my idol oh they're kind of just a bit confused here so here's the moments of truth i said to her i want to give you your dream pet if i can be in a video please she said um what i'm feeling like she's a bit confused so i'm not gonna call her a scammer right now so I said to her, you're Froggy, right? And by the way, I don't even know who on earth Froggy is. So I just said Froggy underscore lol lol. And that's not even a real person. So she's saying yes. However, this isn't even a real person. She's like, that's me. So let's go ahead and tell her to come over with us. Since it's two crowds over here and everyone's going to start pretending to be famous. So I'm just going to be like, I want a screeny because I want to act like a real fan. And then she's like, okay, so she's following us. Oh my god, screenshot! And I'm actually gonna take a screenshot as well. Slay. Okay, let me take a screenshot, guys. And then we're gonna edit it. So, oh my god, look, we got a screenshot with my idol called Froggy. Lol, lol, lol. That isn't even a real person, but anyways. Scam. Oh, what a perfect screenshot. So, I said thank you, and I'm gonna ask her if I can be in her video because she's still pretending to be famous. She's like, of course. This girl isn't really honest because she keeps pretending to be that froggy girl that I just completely made up. I just asked her for a mini shout out, and she's like, of course. Oh my days, guys, she's so not honest, and she's such a liar. I told her to follow me so then I can see how famous she is, if she even is famous. Okay, I will follow ASAP. I am on phone. Um, okay. She's being pretty nice. We've been standing here for five minutes and she still hasn't followed me yet. No, I am on phone. Um, okay, kind of makes sense. But I'm just gonna be like, okay, who cares? I'll just be like, will you follow me after I give your dream pet? Hmm, what's this? If I follow you back, I'll have to leave. Yes, okay, so she's gonna give me um, a follow back as soon as I give her her dream pet, which is pretty cool. My dream pet is a bat dragon and a giraffe. Wow, um, okay, that's some pretty good dream pets. I'm telling her to pick one. She said yes, it doesn't matter. So I'm just going to trade her and put in the mega giraffe, even though I'm not actually going to accept or give it to her. Oh my god, thank you. <laughs> now she's kind of acting like a fan when I give fans dream pets. I'm just going to be like, okay, no problem. I said to her, wait, if I give you more pets, will you give me more shout outs? And she's like, girl, you don't have to give more. Oh, she's not even greedy. That's actually nice. She's like, she's actually quite nice. I mean, she's a liar, but she's not really a greedy scammer. So I don't know. I'm going to say to her, I really want more shout outs oh okay so she said i'll give you shout outs i'm gonna go ahead and put in all my best pets that i said that i would put in um for more shout outs 
that's literally so nice of you okay so i said to her wait so all of this for shout outs even though i don't really want a shout out or need a shout out but anyways of course i'll shout out in every video i said to her are you recording post this on your tiktok oh she's saying you can always remove i don't really care you're so nice i think she means like i can remove any of the pets and she's saying yeah she is recording um okay she's so excited i just accepted the first trade and we just declined uh oh there is somebody called froggy and froggy does not have tiktok and she's kind of just agreeing with me she's literally just admitting it i just said to her you have youtube because froggy does have youtube she's kind of throwing some shade at me are you a fake i have none oh she has none oh my god she started off being very un honest now she's being pretty honest actually i asked her were you trying to scam me and she was like of course gal oh my god i just told her i hate her and i'm just literally gonna run off Hopefully this taught you to be aware of the types of people in Adopt Me. Usually they are scammers that are just trying to lie to get pets from you. If you have ever been a victim from these types of scams, make sure you guys go ahead and watch this video on the tutorial on how to get back your scammed pets. But anyways guys, that was it for today's video. If you enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye everybody!